Hi guys, Flying Fish here, and welcome back to some more Dokkan Battle. We have uh, a brand new stage of the Boss Rush Dokkan event. So they like doing this uh, with every new like anniversary and whatever uh, celebration. So we finally got a new uh, Super Battle Road, Super Battle Road, what are you talking? Uh, Boss Rush stage right here. Uh, so this is against uh, five enemies, like usual, the way they've done this. I I really wish they went back to the formula of these older boss rush stages of having them be just, like, it's just absurdity. Like, I don't know. Back in the day, this boss rush, like, the boss rush used to be, like, the hardest, like, thing you could do in the game. I have like a screenshot that I like I beat this with like the the int team the the Buhan int key 3 all stat 70% team that was insane and that was I believe I did that on the 4th of July too huh so um yeah that was um yeah I don't know that was something but just like nowadays all these boss rushes are just like five like fodder events that like no kind of events like aren't really hard anymore and just like 35 stones because it's not really getting any harder, so... Uh, in the stage, we'll be fighting Bardock, uh, Kaioken Goku, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, Boo, and Kefla. Honestly, I think, um, probably Gotenks is gonna be the hardest fight here, I don't know. And, I, like, none of these fights even have, like, gimmicks, so, like, kind of like the UI Goku who had, like, the insta-kill phase if you didn't, um, you know, like, if, if he super attacked you in his, like, base form stage. Or spirit bomb phase, you know, or like Super Seventeen who absorbs a uh, key blast attacks, or you know, now it's just like just hit them really hard. That's all you got to do. So um, let's not waste too much time. I probably could have just talked all about that when I was actually in here. So we're gonna jump straight into this, and also we're running uh, the seven year teams. I'm just gonna deselect this item right now. We're not gonna need it. Uh, yeah, I don't know, uh, boss rush, woo, <laughs> very fun, um, yeah, sadly, um, really the only purpose of this mode anymore is, uh, for stones, so, yeah, kind of sad, I don't know, um, I'll try to make this quick, <laughs> uh, there's not really too much to say here, it's just, it's, I'm just beating a bunch of Dokkan events, like, that's it, it's, it's it. That's it, you've, you've played a Dokkan event before, like, if you've played a Dokkan event before, then you've, um, you, you've seen Boss Rush already. Yeah, whoa, ooh, that was really, really tough. Um, uh, I guess I should probably find something to talk about. Um, uh, hmm, um, well, um, uh, I did, uh, oh, yeah, there, here's one important thing, uh, uh, so if you guys watch my seven videos <laughs> for these seven year boys, those that amazingly fun, exciting, uh, absolutely incredible summoning video, uh, you would know that um, I ended that video, uh, again, spoilers, um, I ended the saga, well, so far, I've um, still got one video to do with, like, the rainbow tickets, but I ended the saga in, with pulling uh, two copies of the Super Saiyan 4s, and, uh, one copy of the gods, which is, uh, uh, you know, considering, uh, my original plan was to go in here and, like, potentially rainbow them, or at, like, at the minimum, two dupes of each. Um, did not go as planned. Did really not go as planned, you know. 1950 stones for the first copy of the Super Saiyan 4s, uh, Including, not including, like, or it is including, 1950 stones, every fourth multi is free, and all the ticket summons. It, it, that's what it took to pull the first um, copy, Super Saiyan 4s. Uh, by the way, I just want to mention, my uh, two friends uh, actually managed to pull um, these Super Saiyan 4s and the gods on their first couple of tries. Like, maybe within, like, um, in under at least 500 stones. So that's, uh pretty incredible it's um, pretty incredible i am um i back in the back in the day it's this when i first started playing dokkan i went all out well at the time it was all out for me because like it, dokkan was still new for super gogeta str super gogeta when he first dropped 
He was the best unit in the game. I had been saving months for him, which is, you know, the first time I've ever done that because Dokkan is my first gacha game. And I did not pull him. I did not pull him. And then uh, my sister, she actually, uh, she installed Dokkan then and there and then uh, pulled Gogeta. And so that was, um, yeah, I was uh, a bit depressed after that. <laughs> Oh no, that's not that, not really. That's 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 a little too extreme. But um, yeah, it's now seven years seven years later. I'm just I'm just kind of used to it. I'm just at this point. I'm just kind of happy for them. I'm if listen if I had to get absolutely demolished for some of you guys to get good luck out there, then it was I'm I'm absolutely okay with that. Because, you know, because it's like every, you, like, for every person who gets, like, insanely lucky and pulls, like, this r these rare characters right away, there's someone else out there who is getting absolutely demolished and crushed. So, you know, if that had to be me for my friends to get it, then, you know, I'm cool. I'm cool with that. So, yeah, I'm, ba I'm very, very happy for them. And also, uh, they're playing Dokkan again, which is really really cool um i don't know how long they're gonna be playing this game for um definitely not for as long as i have or have been mm -hmm. but um uh, i don't know it's just kind of nice having some irl friends to talk about delcon with <laughs> uh oh look he survived this enemy survived a uh, one super attack wow pretty impressive <laughs> yeah um i don't know i don't know so um yeah, I don't know. I'm I'm just happy, I guess. <laughs> so yeah, really funny outcome. And also, um, where I was actually going with with this from the start, um, I actually did like a couple multis off screen, and uh, I managed to pull one more dupe for the Super Saiyan Four. So I did get them the two dupes, thankfully. Finally, um, now here's to hoping I could pull some dupes for my gods. Uh, really, really hoping. If I could just pull like two dupes for them, I would be. Uh, incredibly, incredibly happy with that, and then I would be like, uh, then I'd be like comfortable, um, saving up my, um, oh, I should probably play a couple of these. You know, like, for the video, I mean, uh, we'll do it, okay, we'll do it for the last fight, I think. You know, uh, what was I talking about? I don't even know, I get, ah, I just stop getting distracted so easily. But, um, yeah, the next video I'm gonna, the next summon video I'm gonna do will be with the, uh, rainbow tickets for part two of the celebration. Well, do they, or maybe it's part three that you're able to use them. I'm not, I can't completely remember right now, but, uh, I am, I will do all my, uh, rainbow tickets in one video and, you know, hopefully, hopefully we get the gods. That would be, that'd be really, really cool. And then after that, I can start saving for, uh, Beastle! <laughs> oh, that's so... That is so hype. You know, that guy, um... That guy right there, he... Uh, is going to be on so many good teams. He's gonna be on Hybrid Saiyans, Goku's family. He's gonna be on Bond and Master and Disciple. Uh, I can't remember all his categories on the top of my head. He probably will not be in Realm of Gods. Uh, it'll be a Movie Heroes? He, he could be a new Movie Heroes hero. Actually... No, actually, the, um... Well, he could be, but I'm just thinking, like, the gods are a movie hero's leader. So, I don't think they would release two, like, super OP movie hero's leaders back-to-back. -back, but we did get a, you know, Ginyu terrifying conqueror's leader. And then Raditz terrifying conqueror's leader, like, actually back-to-back, -back, you know. Not saying... <laughs> Not that Raditz is good or anything, but he's a 200% leader, and we got them, like, basically back-to-back, -back, so... Oh, I gotta grab a drink. I am... My mouth is dry. Okay, I'm better now. Have you ever, Have you guys ever tried that, um... The... The Propel of uh, flavor packets and water? They are so good. Like, not that I've tried many, like, water flavor packets, but, uh... You know, Propel, Propel is kind of peak, what can I say? Um, this is... This is not sponsored. I... I just, like... I drink the berry flavor. It's very good. You guys should try it if it your, your local supermarket sells it. Oh, oh my gosh! Flying fish, Brayden is shilling for the powder company. <laughs> what can I say? I I like berry powder. 
Walker. Oh yeah, that was that was very hard. Yeah. To... <laughs> Yeah. Uh, two more fights left. <laughs> Let's go. Um, we're on to Super Boo now. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> There's not much I can talk about, really. Uh, so, how'd you guys summons go? How'd your how'd your um, seven year LR summons go? We were talking about that earlier. Did your summons go good? Did you pull? I hope you guys pulled at least one of these new LRs. They are <laughs> they are so monstrously good. Uh, back to my, my my friends um you know they've they've played Dokkan before it's not like they've like starting a like fresh brand new account but it's like at the time like they would pull good characters but they weren't able to like really use them to their fullest potential because of just like these LRs or and stuff like they didn't have like they pulled like all these rare characters but no real there was no real team to run them on and to able to like actually beat their events and stuff and get them fully awakened but thanks to the seven year anniversary and pulling the the gods uh they can run this these super powerful um ascended power and um uh fusion fighter teams and just completely um just like decimate the game with their friend, um, with the friend LR gods on their team. And thanks to that, they're able to actually like, since they're able to do that, they can actually awaken their LR gods in Super Saiyan 4s. And, and with them, they can, they can, they allow them to beat the other Dokkan offense with ease. And then they can get their teams fully maxed out and they can, nothing in the game would be hard anymore. Well, except for the red zone, but they're, <laughs> They're far too new to the game to actually be uh, doing that. Did someone just turn the air conditioning off? I think someone just got up and turned the air conditioning off. I use that to cancel out the sound of me recording. Oh, that is... <laughs> this is why I do not film with uh, people in the house. Uh, you know what? I can just do this. I can just, um, since we're, um... Oh, no, we're not below 50% HP. Oops. Oh, well. I thought we could do the active skill right there, but uh, I was just reminded that um, none of these stages are um, strong enough to get me below 50%, and none of them are strong enough to live for more than one turn. Or really, just more than one attack. Oh, uh, yeah, alright, well, we'll turn on the, um, the, the, the stuff, and we can listen to these uh, very glorious entrance animations and active skills in a moment here. Wait, why can we still get ones in this stage? You know what? I don't. I don't know. I don't care. Uh, okay, final fight. Uh, this is Kalen Khalifa. Oop. That is good. That is so good. That is that is um. This is why Dragon Ball is peak. This is why it's peak right here. Thanks to the hit mobile game Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. Oh, why are why are you up right now getting a drink? It is 4:30 in the morning. Oh, well, I guess this is the only video. <gasps> Oh, let's go, let's go, boy. Uh, goodbye, Kefla. You're not living through this. Uh, what are we at? Seven point five million. Uh, attacks effective against all types, and they have a guaranteed additional super attack coming, which is also attacks effective against all types. <laughs> ah, I love, I love the seven year LRs so much. <laughs> ah. Uh, Kefla, are you even gonna... No. I was, I was thinking of attacking with Super Saiyan 4 Goku, but... Oh, well, Super Saiyan 4 Goku has all his links active here. That's interesting. Okay, that's cool. Uh, gosh, I can't wait for the LR Super Saiyan 4's easy A. They're gonna be so fun to run next to these LR Super Saiyan 4's. 
just sharing like legendary power, Saiyan roar, and all that craziness. I will, <laughs> and then the LR itself, the LR AGL Super Saiyan 4 Goku's just gonna be hitting like 10 million attack stats. Oh, I, I, um, I love Dokkan Battle, unironically. Uh, let's just, uh, let's just, uh, wrap this up here. Why not? The only thing that would make that better is getting to see their Gogeta active skill, the husband active skill. But sadly, um, Kefla can't do anything to us. Now, sadly, very, very sad, but, um, oh no, a super attack. Oh no, oh, oh, oh no, oh, oh, this might hurt like a, a tiny baby bit. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a really tiny baby bit. 8.2 million attack effective against all types. They have a guaranteed second super attack coming. Goodbye. Goodbye. Absolutely audio. <laughs> oh, yeah. That is, um... That's why we don't see the active skill. That's why we don't see the active skill in any of these fights. Okay. Well, uh, there we go. That was the new boss rush stage. Uh, very, very, uh, fun. Uh, how long did that take us? Uh, how long is this video? Oh, 17 minutes. That's not too bad. And we do got our rewards from this. 35 stones. Let's go. I'm gonna be using this in a multi off camera. Because I'm not gonna do a video for one multi summon. So, but, <laughs> whatever. Whatever. It's, <laughs> well, technically it would be three multis. Because I'm gonna get the free one. Then I'll have enough tickets to do... The, wait, do I? Wait, is the next one the free one? Oh, it is. Okay. Um, I don't know. Uh, we're done. We're done. Thank you all so much for watching this boss first video. Um, nothing I can really say here. It's just easy. Uh, I love you all. Um, thank you for watching. Hit like. Love you. Bye. <laughs> uh, blah.